Have you ever wondered what this hole is for? Stay with me and I'll explain right after this. Hey guys, so this is the Velocity Nitro. Many of you guys have seen my shoe review on this. I picked this shoe for this video only because the holes are a little easier to see. But this hole serves a very important purpose that many runners don't know, and that's to tie a runner's knot. Now, before I show you how to, how to do a runner's knot, I'm gonna let you know why you should consider tying your shoes this way. First off, what the runner's knot does, and I've also heard it called a lace lock, is it locks your heel into the back of the shoe. This is important for a couple of reasons, mostly to avoid injury, but it's also for comfort. It's to make sure that your, your foot isn't sliding around in there and you don't get the dreaded black toe. So you get the black toe usually from a toe, one of your toes rubbing or pushing against the shoe during a, during a run. You get a blood blister underneath there and you're gonna lose, lose the bad boy. That's one of the main reasons to do it. Um, it also helps avoid other injuries just because you're more, your shoe, your foot is more stable in the shoe. One other thing it does is it makes it harder for your laces to come undone because as your foot pushes against the laces, it actually tightens the, sh tightens the shoe even more. Okay, so hopefully you guys can, can hear me still. Uh, we'll find out in editing. Okay, so a runner's knot. So you got the two. Here's basically how to do it. You take right before you go in. Now you can go in regular or I prefer to go in the back. You want to match your the way you do it over here. So I, I do two going in the back. So that looks like normal. But the part that's going to change is you're going to go in this way. Okay, so now you have two loops and you have like so. Okay, then you're gonna take this one, you're gonna put it in here, gonna give it a pull. You're gonna take this one, you're gonna pull it in here, you're gonna give it a pull, and there you go. Now it will tighten even harder. So then you just tie your stuff like normal. Voila, you're done. Now. All right, so that's how you tie a runner's knot. I feel like it's the best way to tie your shoes when you're on, you're on your run. Okay, so if you enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a comment, push that like button and hit subscribe. I'm still trying to get to that 100 subscriber mark so I can have a URL that's not silly. I would really appreciate your support. Once again, thank you guys run positive and stay safe out there.